The French President Emmanuel Macron's visit to India on its 75th Republic Day has proven to be more than a mere ceremonial success for both nations. Now, India and France have cemented their ties by signing crucial defence and industrial deals, along with bolstering bilateral partnerships in the field of education and healthcare. Now, a total of nine agreements have been signed. Let's, in fact, dive deep into these. A key highlight is, in fact, the agreement between Tata and Airbus to indigenously produce the H-123 civilian helicopter. The first delivery is expected to be in 2026. This, while another joint production between both the groups is, in fact, taking place in the Indian city of Vadodara, where C-295 military transport aircraft are being made and the H-123 choppers could also be exported by India later. Besides this, plans are also underway for a major maintenance, repair and operation centre for the Rafale jets in New Delhi. Negotiations over the procurement of 26 naval variants of the Rafale jets along with three new Scorpion submarines, is underway. Besides, there are also talks for technology transfer of jet engines. Hindustan Aeronautics Limited and French defence major Safran are holding some advanced level of engagement. Now, the Indo-French defence continues past the stratosphere and into space, where both nations are also collaborating for co-developing, manufacturing and launching satellites. Now, India's space and French space agency Ariane Space have been affirmed and both sides will in fact aim to co-develop, manufacture and launch satellites while carrying out research and development in launch vehicle technologies. Now, apart from these major developments, India and France have also agreed to bolster naval coordination in the Red Sea to secure crucial trade routes. Furthermore, negotiations over the procurement of 26 naval variants of Rafale jets along with three new Scorpion submarines are also on the way. Now, this marks the tip of the iceberg in terms of technological collaboration in many different spaces including cyber, defense and artificial intelligence. We will continue to strengthen it with the goal of aligning with Make in India but doing so by exchanging technologies in a serene manner, producing as well and making India a production hub for all our partnerships in the region. Now, Indo-French collaboration does not end in the ambit of defence. The French President Manuel Macron has confirmed on Friday that France is in fact aiming to welcome nearly about 20,000 Indian students by 2025 and 30,000 students by 2030. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.